up guys? Just wanted to do a quick video, uh, kind of a pocket dump to show you what I carry on my person every day. My very first YouTube video was a review of the Maxpedition EDC organizer and I showed some of the some of the items that I carry with me in my bag. But some items you know you use so often that you don't want to have to dig through a bag to get them. And those items you carry on your person. I don't want to look like Batman or something with a ton of gadgets on my belt. So I kind of have a mix between uh, being a minimalist but still carrying everything that I really like to and need to um, throughout the day. So I'll show you what I have on my person um, at all times. Of course I carry my wallet in my pocket. It has my cards, some cash, identification, that kind of thing. Um, so I always have that. Of course a phone. I carry my phone in my pocket and right now this is I know old school it's the iPhone 4 still it's getting old but I take good care of my stuff so it's in great shape works just fine for me and uh, it's stayed in great shape thanks to the spec candy shell that's what I'm rocking right now I've been through a few different cases this is my favorite really smooth on the outside hard plastic doesn't catch in my pocket when I slide in and out but on the inside it's lined with uh, with rubber so impact and shock resistant this has survived a couple falls off of eight foot ladders all the way down onto the floor and well it survived very well so anyway this is what I'm using now I do have problems with the case every spec candy shell I've ever bought breaks right here doesn't affect the form or function really just looks ugly always cracks right there but oh well so that's that Next, I don't know if you know what this thing is. This is a Fitbit. A Fitbit One is the model here. And this I got to help me with uh, some of my weight loss goals. I thought I would drop a few pounds this year and so far I have. I think lost about 12 pounds since New Year's. But this is a, a smart pedometer. Counts steps. There we go. This counts how many flights of stairs you've climbed, the distance you've traveled, estimates your calories that you've burned, and there's a fun little flower. The taller it grows, uh, it means the more active you are. So my goal is to reach 10,000 steps a day. I'm at 8,700, so I got to do some more before bed. But anyway, so this is just a fun way to. And make you know help you get more active, especially if you're sitting at a computer a lot during the day. Um, it motivates you to get up. Takes the stairs instead of the elevator. Get around. Takes extra walks during your break just to try to build your step count. Always have a pin with me. This is a change from my old EDC video. I did a review on this Zebra Expanse, which I still really like this pin. But you just can't beat the space pin. Fisher space pin, mainly I'm talking about the refills here, the ink itself. That's awesome. I wish I could get that refill to fit in here. I just can't. But if you're writing on a greasy pizza receipt or plastic or something, space pin never fails. Carried this with me every day for oh, probably two years now, I think, a year and a half at least. Um, the clip is showing a little bit of wear. But I've never lost this pin out of my pocket. It's always there when I need it. I love that. I usually have a paracord bracelet on. Not always, but I, I, I wear them because I like the looks of them. This one I just made out of gray and caustic green paracord. I like the looks of them, so I usually have one of those on. Uh, whatever color I feel like wearing. This is my Spider Co. Paramilitary, Paramilitary 2 knife. Love this pocket knife. My favorite knife ever. I got it after watching a bunch of reviews on, on YouTube and suggestions. And man, it just feels great in my hand. It's a nice size. It's a large knife, but it fits just fine in my pocket. I used that pocket clip and I think I showed you. I did. I showed you this guy in another video recently. Just this skull I carved out of acrylic. Just a little ornament here for my knife. 
Now I'm not a, <laughs> I'm not much of an artist. Now I can doodle and draw on paper, but when it comes to engraving or carving, never tried anything like this, like this in 3D. And so this is my first attempt, and heck, it turned out pretty well, I think. So give it a try if you want to try carving. There's a fun project for you. Also, my flashlight. I use my flashlight quite a bit. Not because I have a weird job where I'm always looking in dark places, but just normal day-to-day -day stuff. I, I use this flashlight. Um, this is the Phoenix LD12. I love this light. I've been through a couple different lights. Um, smaller and bigger than this, but this fits on my person just fine. It's not too big or bulky, and yet it it works just great and it only takes one double a battery one double a battery and you could get some power out of this i should probably do a separate review of some more specs on this light but you now one one thing i wanted was a flashlight that um, had a push button to to get different modes because i didn't like the twisty kind i wanted a, a button to go between high I see like low, medium, high, turbo. I wanted a button and this Phoenix did it for me. So love this, not, uh, love this light. And of course this holster I showed in another video that I made one evening. It's a little bit ugly, but it works perfect. It's made out of Kydex, uh, formed perfectly for my belts. And knife, or my flashlight snaps right into that. So I'm loving that combo. Of course, I got my keys. Carry my keys in my po well. No, I don't. I don't carry my keys in my pocket anymore. I use this belt clip, which is really handy. So I clip them on my belt, and usually my T-shirt still goes over those, which helps them from jingling around too much. Um, but I hated digging through my pockets to get my keys, and I don't like my keys in my pockets scratching up my phone or scratching up my knife real bad. So I use this clip, this goes onto my belt, and it's simple, one-handed, you can get this on and off. So that's what I use for my keys. And last but not least, my newest piece of equipment here. I just got this new Casio Pathfinder 1500T, T for titanium, excuse me, titanium band here. Man, I'm loving this watch. Just great looking watch. I'll probably do a separate video of this one if you want. Just let me know in the comments. I'll give you my thoughts. So far, I'm loving this watch. Um, before, I was just rotating a few different G-Shocks, including this 6900. Sorry, a little bit of fingerprints on there. This 6900 G-Shock. Or this 7800 which I got a couple years ago. Really hard to find this guy. I love this watch. Got it on eBay and you can still find it, but man, the price tripled since I bought this just because I guess they're not making it anymore. This is my Casio G-Shock 7800. So these will still be in rotation, I'm sure, but this guy's not, le le this guy's not leaving my wrist anytime soon. Great watch, looks great too. Anyway, that's it guys, that's what I got on my person every day, stuff I'm using all the time. I thought I'd throw up a video and let you know because I'm still getting comments on my EDC organizer, um, you know, of things that I need to add. And the fact is I have those on my person and that's why they're not in that EDC organizer. So here's a review of what's in my pockets and on my belt every day. Thanks for watching guys. Hey, if you're a gadget nut like me, please take a moment, hit the like button down below, and subscribe if you like. Take care. What's up guys? Uh, after I ended that video, I figured I'd show you how or where I carry all these items. So if you're still with me, here's some bonus content. I uh, have my watch on my left wrist, paracord bracelet on my right, front right pocket, and the small coin pocket here is where I carry that Fitbit One. The step counter tucks in there. My Spyderco para, Paramilitary 2 pocket knife is in my front right pocket. And my Phoenix LD12 in the Kydex holster on, uh, let's see, on my right hip. 
Back here is my wallet. Don't be mugging me now, you know where I keep my wallet. Right back there. Opposite back pocket, my left back pocket is where I keep my, my uh, Fisher Space Pen. And over here on my left hip is where I clip my keys. And finally, front left pocket is where I keep my cell phone. Thanks for watching, guys.